I just wanted to do an update video on Savannah Minor for you guys that seen uh, the first one. Obviously the cage is a lot bigger. I rebuilt the cage. That's the old one. Just a 40 gallon. Definitely outgrow it. Um, but yeah, I was going to kind of just go over the basics of what I did. It's really easy. I thought it was going to be a lot of work and a lot of money. But um, it ended up not being. It's just literally, I think they're uh, two by sixes, I think. Like this big one right here. And then just two by fours. And that's literally all I used. Two by fours and then like, I think like four pieces of the two by sixes. Maybe two by eight, maybe. I don't know exactly. So then I just built this little like kind of like hide shelf thing for him to chill on. And then over here, what I did was I, um, I don't know if you can see it really. But um, I lined the wood with gar like a bunch of thick uh, garbage bags. So that way the wood doesn't get wet from the humidity and the dirt and sand. I just put a hide in there and stuff from the climb on. And I put the piece up, another 1x8 or 2x8 or whatever it was. Put it up like a ramp and then it goes up to the top. Down below, I guess I can open the door. That would make more sense. One second. All right. So, yeah. And then down below, I just put a really big water bowl, food dish. And then there's like another hide with the, and then I, uh, this green stuff here is like a repti carpet. I just cut it to size, kind of, kind of ghetto, but it does a job. I plan on adding more plants to the back and whatnot. I just haven't done it yet. Um, up top I have his UVB and the heat bulb. And he seems to really enjoy it. He likes hiding in the hide, digging in the dirt. There's definitely a lot more space for him. Then that little 40 gallon. That's him. It's getting big. It's getting really big. That's the size of my hand. Oh, he's not too happy. But he's big. Eating a lot. And then on top, I just made it so I gotta uh, put tanks on top. Save some room. Crickets. Just a little rack I have. But yeah, I just want to do a quick video. If you guys have any questions, just let me know. Um, obviously it's wood, so I gotta be really careful with moisture. That's why I put the garbage bags down. Look at him. Look at his little chubby. Little chubby jobs. He got egg all over his face. Well, that's him or her. I don't know if it's a boy or girl, to be honest. Let's see what kind of mood he's in today. Oh, he's not too happy. Okay, all right. All right, I'll leave you be. But yeah, guys, like I said, just a little update. Let me know what you guys keep your Savannah mon in, or monitor in. Definitely like to know. Um, I think, yeah, it's six foot by two and a half feet wide. So it should be big enough for a, a while, at least till maybe she or he is full grown. Um, but yeah, that's all I really gotta say about it. To be honest, I think it costs like $150 total, not including tools. I had to buy some tools and stuff that I didn't have, but the nails are cheap, the chicken wire is cheap. The biggest pain in the butt was the chicken wire, is cutting it <clears throat> to the size and stapling it all on, make sure it doesn't come off. As you can see, I didn't do a very good job of measuring it, so I gotta do the outside over. Make it look better. Not over, but I'm just gonna add two by fours and stuff just to so hide the chicken wire so it kind of looks like the door does. Where you can't see the ends of it, it just looks flush and nice. Um, but yeah, guys, that's it pretty much. Uh, one more thing I did add, which is just kind of, I don't know, it's not really that big of a deal, I guess. But I'll show you. I just added lights on the inside. Let's turn this light off real quick. You can kind of see it. I guess, hold on, let me turn these lights off. I have the bearded dragon lights on, so that probably covers it too, but. Yeah, it's a lot better. You can kind of see I just put the blue lights. Or not blue lights, just the lights in general. Up there, I gotta like change it, different colors. Red and green. Do regular light. Blue again. You do some blue, some red if you like aim it right. But it's just something I added just to make it look a little bit better, I guess, when it's dark. You should put on a timer. Put these lights back on. 
Hey right, guys, let me know what you think. Let me know in the comments below on this new house. If you guys built your own enclosures or purchased them, let me know. I just didn't want to buy a really big tank. I felt like it'd be a lot of money. I'd rather have him in like open air, give him a lot of space for dirt to dig. Could almost, I think it's almost a foot because you can see a two by four is there. I think it's eight inches, so it's probably a little bit less than a foot deep. I might build it up a little bit more. I don't know yet. I'm gonna add some stuff to it, try to make it a little bit better. But he's in it for about two weeks now, and he seems to really like it. He sleeps down there under that little hide, and then he's always up here during the day, or over there digging, doing whatever. So yeah, guys, have a great rest of the day, and thanks for watching. I appreciate it.